Hey y'all, I'm Blake Brunson with House Beautiful. We are going to tour this beautiful Victorian townhouse designed by Sarah and Jim Hill. Let's take a look. Hey, how are you? Hi, welcome to Brooklyn. Thank you. Thanks so much for having me. Yeah, come on in. What a lovely home. Thanks, thanks, welcome. This is exactly where I want to be on this chilly fall day. So tell me about what you did here. So we just finished wrapping up on the complete renovation of this Clinton Hill brownstone, where we converted this house from a single family house to a two family house. So it's got a ground level apartment and a triplex above. It's interesting to me how well new furniture fits in this old house. We really like when we don't have to just scrub the whole place clean and just bring in all new furniture. It really creates a much more layered, nuanced project when you can you know, bring in the old things, have new things, and mix them all together in perhaps a new, fresh way. All right, well, let's see the rest of the house. Yeah, come on. Okay, and so here's the stair that we were talking about. So you painted it black. <laughs> Tell me about that. Well, it was a collaboration between the homeowner and us. Uh, she really wanted to accentuate the architecture that was existing in the space. She loves the paneling, loves the columns, loves how it feels. So by painting it black, it really becomes this really beautiful, dramatic space. As we walk into the kitchen, it's one of the biggest rooms in the house. <laughs> I like that. Well, always. The kitchen is the heart of the house, right? This room originally was the formal dining room, and when they decided to buy this home and want to turn it into the garden level apartment, the kitchen had to naturally move upstairs, and what better place than this beautiful room? So, one of the things I find most interesting about this kitchen is that the cabinets are from Ikea. Yeah, it is an Ikea hack, as they like to call it. The lower cabinets and this big pantry unit are all Ikea with custom-made front. This space was originally a servant's uh, circulation space, so it just had a stair going downstairs and it had a dumbwaiter over in this area, and that was it. It's just so quiet and peaceful. You feel so connected to the garden outside. It's literally one of my favorite spots. And this is the powder room. No. Oh wow, that's fun. This is a Ferrum Ball wallpaper uh, that the client selected out and it, it gives you that really great pop when you open up the door. It's kind of unexpected given everything is so quiet and serene and then you open the door, it's wow. This is the master bedroom. What's really kind of different is that we've actually changed these windows so they're extra quiet and it blocks out a lot of the street noise so you get that quiet peacefulness that everybody wants in their master bedroom. So this is the client's master bathroom and uh, originally they had a tub in here and a sink sink. Uh, which we completely redid and we totally re-altered how the space flows. So I was in the shower and now I'm outside. Yeah. <laughs> you don't see that every day. No, you don't. You don't. Again, the client really wanted to make sure that every square inch of this house was hyper-functional. I like to think of a house as a, a living thing. You're never quite done with it. It should evolve. You evolve as a person, you change, you know, and your house should be able to move and function and breathe the way you do, too. Sarah, Jim, thank you so much for having us and showing us around. Really great job, and I can't wait to see what you do next. Thank you very much for coming. Thanks so much for coming over. Thank you.